In this video, I will guide you how to submit the e-invoice using the million software by using the second method where you can immediately submit the e-invoice after you save the invoice. I will show you the second way to submit the standard e-invoice where you can submit the e-invoice immediately after you save the invoice. You go to System, Administrative Tools and then Document Number. Here you need to do some setting where you select the sales invoice, Edit. And then at here, uh, you need to do settings for data access point where you need to select the e-invoice and then click save. After do this setting, you can immediately send the e-invoice after you save the invoice. Now you can go to sales, invoice. Now I will create new invoice. And then you will choose your data. Make sure that the date is correct. And then you choose the product and then click save product and then after you click save it will prompt up and a message do you want to send the transaction to the invoice portal then you can click save yes then the invoice is already submitted lah. then next i will create a new invoice And then I select the product. But for this invoice, the customer didn't request a standard e invoice. So I can choose no, so it will not send to the e invoice portal. Then you can see that the invoice that you have created, if not validated, it will black in color. If validated, it will show blue in color. Then you go to sales, sales report, and then the invoice document. Here, I need to check the invoice for both document, then click refresh. Here you can see that one of the invoice has already sent to my invoice portal. Then if the customer um, want to send an invoice, you can click here and then click send. Then now both of the invoice is already submitted to the my invoice portal. 